Hopeless hated Brexit deal C0 ULD shatter UK as Boris cannot chart safe route out. Little, if any, progress appears to have been made in the latest round of talks over the Northern Ireland Protocol. London negotiators have again threatened to trigger Article 16, but their Brussels counterparts have signalled that a trade war would be launched if they did. Commentators insist that the stakes are high, that the protocol risks altering not merely a few trading percentages but the very makeup of the United Kingdom itself. Businessman Ben Habib said this could not only push Northern Ireland out of the UK, but also give Scotland a renewed desire to go independent. He told Bournebrook magazine a failure by the UK government to get a grip on the talks could result in Irish reunification, followed by Scotland also having a crack at leaving the Union. The Brexit Watch chairman did not pin much hope on the government to push for the changes required to make the post-Brexit situation in Northern Ireland workable. Among many criticisms of the protocol is its role in ensuring checks on goods moving from Britain to Northern Ireland, that is, from one part of the UK to another. Mr Habib insisted the Conservative Party government is helpless and cannot be relied upon to resolve the matter. He said, our hapless government hasn't got the wherewithal to chart a safe route for the UK. A person familiar with the matter earlier this month told Bloomberg Brussels would likely suspend its trade agreement with the UK if ministers revoke their commitments over the protocol. They added this could even impact separate talks, and could, for example see negotiations over the status of Gibraltar halted. Brexit ear Lord Hannan said the EU was holding this line not because of necessity but for political points. He insisted this demonstrated the bloc's determination to treat Britain as a wayward province rather than an ally. The Tory peer added, nothing the UK proposes will hurt the EU. Instead, Mr Habib warned that Brussels wanted effectively to take Northern Ireland as a cost of Brexit, perhaps as a warning sign to other EU member states looking for the exit. He said the EU was open with us from the start that the price of Brexit would be Northern Ireland. The Tory peer added, nothing the UK proposes will hurt the EU. Instead, Mr Habib warned that Brussels wanted effectively to take Northern Ireland as a cost of Brexit, perhaps as a warning sign to other EU member states looking for the exit. He said the EU was open with us from the start that the price of Brexit would be Northern Ireland.